Instructors like to think that all students leave class with a squeaky clean understanding of the concepts taught, but often that's not the case. For some students, the ideas just aren't clear. So what's an instructor to do? Ask the students, what's the muddiest point? A muddiest point is anything that's unclear or confusing to students. And you can use the muddiest point as a learning opportunity. The technique works in face-to-face, -face, blended, and online courses. Here's how to do it. Immediately after a class activity, say a lecture, discussion, or reading, have students write down what they didn't understand. In a small face-to-face -face class, you can use index cards to collect the questions. After class, analyze the students' responses and use them to clarify the muddy points during the next class. But what if you teach a larger class or teach online? Here are some examples that can help. Imagine you give your students an assignment to listen to a podcast about a complex topic. When they're done listening, ask them, what was the muddiest point? And tell them to respond using the class's online discussion forum. You can set up the discussion forum so students can't see each other's posts. That way, each student gets to post a question or comment without being influenced or intimidated by other students. After all the students have responded, read what they wrote and sort the responses into themes. Then write a blog post clarifying the muddiest points. Or post the themes to the discussion forum and tell the students to pick a theme they understand and then explain it to classmates who don't understand. Another way to address the muddiest point is to let students see each other's posts in the online discussion forum and have them explain the topic to each other. You keep an eye on the forum, chiming in if the students go way off course, but otherwise you let them work it out. Then you can answer any lingering questions in the next class or right there in the discussion forum. For really large face-to-face -face classes, clickers can help. Clickers are handheld devices that look like a remote control. Students use them to respond to multiple choice questions or polls you create to figure out what they don't understand. Students punch in their answers and their responses are immediately displayed as a graph that tells you how many students get it or which topics need more explanation. You can then spend more time in class on the muddy areas. When you ask students to identify their muddiest point, you not only help them to understand the material better, you also teach them to think about their own thinking. And you get good feedback that tells you where to focus your teaching. By asking about the muddiest point, you help everything become clear.